today is the start of Cabo Black. It's currently 5.45. I'm tired as hell. But let me show you guys my outfit because it's really cute. It's from Fashion Nova. Airport vibes cute. So I'll see you guys once we start the drive to the airport. And have a blessed morning. Have, like the two for five sausage egg McMuffin? I'm sorry, one more time. Do you guys still have like the two for five sausage egg McMuffin? She can like not understand him. <laughs> We're getting McDonald's. Breakfast hall. What'd you gotta say, hater? <laughs> Do you guys just realize she pulled up to the drive thru with socks in her hair? Did you realize? Dame vale dos, tres, cuatro vergas. Comes. You, hey. Yeah. What's four plus four? Eight. You didn't do that. Oh yeah, what's five plus five? Ten. That in that your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> so McDonald's, huh? This food makes me feel like, like dookie every damn time, but it's so good. What? Yesterday when I went to go get my wax, baby, like almost <laughs> myself, because I ate this in the morning. Que se quita la ropa cara. Anyways, two hash browns. <laughs> Bob, we oh, got two McMuffins. What do you guys get from breakfast at McDonald's? Yeah, what do you? What is your go-to? Like, what's your go-to? I used to get hotcakes until one time I was literally going to a soccer practice in high school, like hella early, like 6 a.m. I got hotcakes. I had a shit so bad that I literally walked to my best friend's house, which was like a 30 minute walk. I didn't walk. I ran because I was it was about to fall out. <laughs> so don't get hotcakes. So I lied when I say I walked because I ran. Because I ran. So breakfast, yeah, boom. Every morning I went to go work. Okay. In the time, it was two for four sausage egg with muffin. Damn. Me right. And now it was like, buy one, get one for one dollar. You got four? Babe, two for four is two. Oh, two for four dollars. <laughs> and if y'all don't know, for lunch in college, I had to get the four for four from Wendy's. Thank you for this. Valuable information. With the student discount, so it was like three dollars. Feel me? Ah. Scam them Wendy O's. We'll see y'all in Bakersfield. Yeah, so it finally worked this time. The heatless curls. I just woke up. I woke up like this. Look at him. Being a dad, I'm hey. This trip was real stressful. I'm gonna tell y'all everything because my mom likes to play games and make everybody late. Y'all remember when she made us all late in Florida? Like the whole entire family? Plus Nay and her mom. By the way, we came with my best friend and her mom also. Spending the whole vacay with them and my family, but they're on their way. But they might be late, thanks to my mom. How was your nap? You know, it's your boy D.O. Double G on the game. What nap? I ain't nap. I just put my eyes closed because I always woke. Okay. Look at them Wait. toes. Why my they, toes are cute. Why are they looking away from each other, boy? Maybe that's how toes are. That's not how my toes are. My toes like kissing. You want to show your airport fitness? This is my best friend. Right here. Special oh. guest. Oh. <laughs> best friend number two, best friend number one. Yeah, since birth. Do you like how my hair came out? Yeah. It's like, whatever. It looks like I just got the salon. <laughs> and you're mad. And then I got my glasses to block out the fucking haters. Yeah. yeah. That Ben glass is fake. Where are you getting them from? Fashion Nova, baby, in the outfit, too. Oh, yeah, my hat, Gucci. <laughs> my shirt, Mohammed Ali. Pants, they're cargoes, it's style. Pants from Target. Sorry, too much noise. My private jet is actually just landing right now to pick us up. So just let's chill. Just, chill just, just relax. Like, don't be mad. Don't be mad. Be glad. <laughs> Look at his thumb. <laughs> Who has a better looking thumb? Boy. Like. Is this a thumb competition? I need lip liner ASAP because this is not cute. You need a makeover. You need to damn wash your damn ass. You need to leave. You <laughs> Everybody look at Miss Dramatic right here. Miss Marianne Dramatic. <laughs> dramatic one, dramatic two, dramatic three. Rachel's not dramatic, she's cool. No, cool one, no, cool two. If I'm dramatic, Rachel's dramatic. How? Cool Rachel's cooler than you. Oh, I beat her at Among Us. He was like, what color are you? And I was like, red, but I wasn't red. He's like, everyone it's red and then it wasn't me so they all put him out. 
<laughs> they all voted you out. They booted me. Yo, they still playing Among Us in 2023. Because <laughs> he wasn't even gonna play Roblox. Okay. Yeah, I didn't even play Ooh. Roblox. His Taurus outfit is so cute. Mr. These are the fire styles. Mr. Matic number five. The most stressful trip of my life, thanks to her. Yeah, why is there literally no elevator? Look at this. <laughs> False alarm, y'all. We found the elevator. They couldn't identify him. They couldn't believe me. It's not my fault. I got a nose job. <laughs> they were staring at me hard. Like, the guy was about to slap me like, you don't look like him. <laughs> they said he didn't look like the passport or his ID. And we we're like, well, why didn't you show the Mexican ID? Because that one's recent. And he was like, I didn't want to risk it. Yeah, imagine I saw him the Mexican one and like, go back to your country. Send that ad back. Yeah, I just ordered us two Fredo wraps for me and Michael. Bam. I also got my lemonade. Bam. Iced green tea peach lemonade, actually. Y'all, look how cute she looks in her little outfit. Oh. Y'all, we just arrived in Cabo. Puros gringos. This chilaquiles are about to be so damn expensive, I already know. And I know they're gonna be oh. asked too. All I have to say to that is dirty. Cancel, cancel. <laughs> she was so chill the whole flight, right? Yeah. No. No? Yeah, she was. <laughs> oh, so we're at the airport right now. Tell me why the currency is 13 pesos a dollar. Exchange rate. They're literally scamming over here. And it's working because all the motherfuckers are going there. I said, no. We're going to Santander. Okay, we're going to the bank. Y'all, look at these f***ing prices. 400 pesos for quesadillas, a three piece. Are you serious? Amaya. She fixed it, yeah. Oh, you're so smart. <laughs> it's your birthday. It's your birthday. She in Cabo for her first. Can y'all believe that? I know, for my first. What do I remember? <laughs> <laughs> okay, y'all, so I'm about to do a little tour of the apartment we're staying at. It's like a resort apartment. It has three rooms or two rooms, but it's really nice. Let me show you. So starting off with the baddie. Um, yeah. Gonna eat every damn time. This is my parents' bathroom, I think. The light in here sucks. Like, like, that's literally the only light. But it's really cute, and I love this, like, pink red mirror. Even though you can't see shit. So, yeah, this is the room. Cute. The TV bomb. I like the little setup. It's just so dark in here. Closet. Let's see what this is. Um, cute. And this is the hallway. This is the door where we walk into. This is a cute mirror. I'm definitely gonna be taking some pictures here. Bam. Okay, so I think this is gonna be me and Michael's room. Bomb, he's already been a gusto. Boy. Okay, so this is our closet. This is cute. The lighting is better in here. And then we also have the same TV. Oh and we got a little yeah. Rachi. Thank you. Thank you for that. <laughs> and then we got like the same bathroom setup. Bomb.com. This looks like you can open it, but like, but like how? Like it looks like a door. Am I tripping? Wait, what? Ever. <laughs> Okay, so here's another bathroom. Cute, it's not connected to a room, but bomb. I like this tub, that's real cute. And the lighting in here, bomb. And why did somebody leave their trash right here? This is the kitchen, real cute, simple, but like it comes with everything we need, so bomb. And then fridge, 
Oh, they left us some snackies. What is that? I look a little bit dirty, but whatever. Oh, they left us more snackies, but I know we're gonna have to pay for these. And then the living room setup is so cute, honestly. I love the color. Cute mirror once again. I'm gonna be taking some cute pictures in there. And then this is our little patio. It's very resort style, I'll tell y'all that. It's very touristy, like I feel like I'm in hey, South Carolina right now. We're about to go eat some pizza because we're all dying of hunger. We're hangry. got my bestie on the vlog yet. You know who we are. You know you're number two. Like, <laughs> when I say bestie number two, you can come in, eh? But yeah, she's spending the whole trip with us what and her mom. Bomb. Bro, bomb. Just wait for the pictures on Instagram, okay? Right. I'm gonna hire them for you, eh? <laughs> to sing you a love song of our friendship. <laughs> Currently, y'all, it's 5.55, 6, and this restaurant opens at 6, and we're gonna eat, like, some pasta and stuff. The prices are really crazy. You know, so. we're eating some pasta rasta in Cabo. A this girl, no se lo lavo. Tu culo. No hablas de. I just can't wait to chill this whole week. Everybody stay tuned for the weekly vlogs that I'm gonna post the video after this, okay? Just wait for it, cause it's gonna be a little more fun. So this is our table, real nice on the seat. Our bread arrived. Y'all, not gonna lie, this is the most like painfully American stuff ever, but we all literally ordered pepperoni pizza and chicken alfredo. Chicken alfredo. Chicken Alfredo, chicken Alfredo. <laughs> Michael wanna be different so bad. I actually hopped in the in the kitchen right now. I was like, let me cook like my own stuff. Let me cook. Let me cook. And then let, let, let him cook. Richie, Richie, open the door. Open the door. I'm a surprise me. And Nay's looking like a model over here. She literally just woke up. I'm wearing the same shorts as yesterday. You record yesterday? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, these actually, these are like brand new shorts. So let's basically say what the hell's going on. Today is Nay's B day. Um, so yeah, we just woke up like an hour or two ago. It's 11:46. Our parents left to go watch like this presentation mm -hmm. to get some free stuff, and it's like 90 minutes long, like hella sketch. And they haven't texted us, none of us. So I'm calling my mom, calling my dad, none of them are answering. I'm thinking they're kidnapped. This place is kind of sketchy. Dude, this place is like a Black Mirror episode. <laughs> Since we got here, it's just like He's full. Yeah. So <laughs> no, it's like full of like people just trying to like take you to the hotels. The airport is just in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. There's like not really stuff nearby. It's just full of like taxis and like selling drinks. Woo, fun. And, like hella expensive, but like it's sketch because we're in the middle of nowhere. So we landed in San Juan del Cabo and we need to drive to all the way to Cabo San Lucas. While we're going through here, it's just a bunch of ranchos and stuff like that. It wasn't really looking nice. So now Telera, the hotel zone, we get here, oh, all of a sudden it's hella nice. We can see across the street and it looks like dusted it out. Looks like yeah. a, it looks like a little city, not for tourists. Every single little thing, they gotta take like your room number and they charge you for everything, bro. I think that's pretty normal. <laughs> I'm like, literally every single place we've been in Mexico, nothing looked like this. This is like straight Dude. tourist. They charge yeah. for good Wi-Fi. They charge yeah. for Wi-Fi, bro. Every day. The TV don't even got Netflix. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> it might. We just might be in an old place. This is literally because my mom got this trip by watching those presentations. <laughs> she called her mom and she answered, and they're all good. But they're like in a place with no reception, so we're like. Yeah, I could barely hear her. Like barely. Imagine they told her to say that. Ducks. <laughs> 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 Funny, no reception. <laughs> now we're hungry. Like, where's our parents at? <laughs> they leave stuff in the fridge and we can't even eat it. Or they charge oh, yeah. us for it. Alex. Oh, yeah. yeah. No, and Alexis smart self. She saw a basket full of treats. Oh, look, they gave us a surprise basket. <laughs> she started eating stuff. I only ate the nuts. Relax. relax. Oh, we know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my bad. Anyways, uh, we need to get dressed and we don't know what we're gonna do today, but we're trying to go to the beach. I'm trying to go to the pool. Oh, I mean, I mean the pool. Today's July 18th or 19th? 19th. Today's July 19th. You don't even know birthday? There's too many of y'all damn birthdays. <laughs> Good morning, USA. I got a feeling that I'm gonna be 
Get on me, get on me. That, that was it, you only get one shot at this. You only get one shot at the fame, and when you come in at the fame, and then we go in at the game. Game, game, you don't even show my name. You should've done them toes. I asked you guys to take me with you. <laughs> okay guys, welcome to Get Ready With Me and Victoria. We're gonna go to the pool today. Well first, we're gonna go to this little shop to get something to eat, because we're all starving, and our parents just abandoned us here. So, <laughs> oh, like get ready with my products? <laughs> I guess it's get ready with Alexis's products. If you have sisters, y'all already know. I need to put my contacts in first because I cannot see. Should I open this? Because this is not echoey. Yeah. So Hello. this is what's in Alexis's makeup bag. <laughs> Are you doing your makeup and everything? No, I'm just gonna do a little bit. I don't think I'm gonna do anything. So this is my get ready with me. I hate being blind, bro. Like, why me? I didn't choose this. I don't think I told you guys when we were going on our rant about like how this place is kind of sketch But I think I showed in this vlog actually the whole like tour of this hotel or whatever And there's like these doors in the bathroom. They look like doors. They look like they open, but they don't open So it's sketch. It's sketch. I hate like when I go in places and there's secret doors like that's so scary <sighs> But not gonna lie. I think somebody just flushed the toilet and it sounded like hella water So I think that's just the water like tank like maybe I watch too many crime documentaries and too many crime podcasts. But it's always good to be safe, aware, okay, of your surroundings because there is weirdos in this world, like for sure. Oh, 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 oh. Earrings are bad. This angle's really cute. Like I need to do, start doing more high angles, like Facebook mom. Because it makes me look good and it makes me look like snatched, you know? Like when I be getting them low angles, bro. Hell no, I'll be looking a damn mess. Okay, so first we're gonna go my sunscreen. I got sent this and I've really been liking it. So I'm gonna just keep it up because I heard zinc oxide sunscreen is bomb. It's by Versed, by the way. And it has sea fennel and moringa seed extract. I love like when things sound natural, even though I know they be lying to us. Like, bro, that's probably not even a real plant. Like, you probably made that up. Just kidding. I'm probably not gonna do a lot. Damn it, I wanted to put my moisturizer on first. This is fine. But yeah, today, I don't even know what we're doing. Like, my parents just left and, like, left us here, like, hungry. Hungry as hell. Not knowing where to go. They kept saying there's, like, a little, like, tiendita here. I doubt it's a tiendita. It's probably a freaking tiendota. It's for the tourists, you know? So I know them prices is gonna be real, real nice, real nice. But we're hella hungry, so we're gonna go there, see what we can find to eat. And then we're gonna go chill at the pool and get a tan on. I want a tan, but sunscreen on the face, that's a must, okay? My skin does not burn, like, my body at all, but my face will burn, baby. Vibes. Guys, I'm back. She's back, woo! So I'm not gonna do any makeup at all. I already put on sunscreen, too. I don't know what I'm gonna do, honestly. I want something really light. So, do you have anything to tell the people? Yeah. Guys, I swear this is not the same outfit I wore yesterday. I'm just wearing the same shirt, but I'm gonna change it. What I'm gonna tell you though, is that I am starting a YouTube channel. Um, I don't even know anything about it yet, but I know I think we're gonna make my first video while we're here. I think we're just gonna do a Q&A. Yo, I've been trying to tell her, hurry up and get up on this YouTube grind, girl. Cause she's so funny. Like she be having me Dead, like literally my stomach hurting. Yeah, but you have to understand it. Sometimes if you don't get it, it's just, I look stupid and I look so. <laughs> but if you don't get it, then you don't get it. Like, I feel like Vicky has like a humor that's like so, it's like all inside jokes, I feel like. <laughs> I think so too. But it's not like inside joke only mean, you know, it's an inside joke that everyone gets. You just have to yeah. get it. Like if you don't get it, then you don't get it. And then you really don't get it. <laughs> but if you get it, then you get it and it's funny. I used to be friends with someone and they didn't get it. <laughs> <laughs> it was really bad and awkward every single time. They wouldn't laugh. I'm like, <laughs> hey, Rachie, come be in the vlog. Tell him, hey, and what's your fit from? I got my RSQ shirt. Oh, she got the Crocs that I bought her. Why do you talk so low, Rachie? You know you're loud. Hey, y'all. My name is Victoria, and I'm wearing this and this. But you don't be shy and loud on that Roblox, huh? Uh huh, voice chat. Um, She's like, that's why you got a British accent. You know my editor is from. <laughs> London. I don't do that. Love you, editor. Love you, editor. What do you mean, editor, bro? I didn't do that, editor, bro. It was her evil twin. Is your yeah. editor actually from London? Yeah, she's my like, best friend lives in London. Who's your best friend? The beta squad. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, well, only Kenny, only Kenny. Let me show you the edits on TikTok. Guys. I she saved them. them. I have a whole collection for beta squad. You or me, without, do you know who Mancon is? Mm -hmm. 
Oh my god, do you know who Mad Con is? I've heard of the name, but I don't really know. They're too young. But yeah, that's how I was with Mad Con. Me and my best friends, we love. If you know who Mad Con is, what Nash is Greer, is? Cameron Dallas, all of them. Like, if y'all know who Mad Con is, you're a real one. That's all I gotta say. And like with One Direction, the girls were upset. Obsessed with One Direction. I was obsessed with One Direction too, but like I on the too. low. <laughs> Alright guys, this is enough for the get rid of me. Is this your other thing? Caitlin. Do my favorite cake. And what? Give me some green cake. Okay guys, we gotta hurry up because we need to get in the pool because I guess we have plans today. Also, sorry y'all had to watch that. <laughs> They're in that age, that phase. Okay y'all, so this is the final look. I ended up literally just doing all my makeup. <laughs> Because it stays on so good that like might as well just do it, you know what I mean? It's gonna stay on while I go swimming. Watch, watch, watch. And if it does, please who sponsor me, please. Somebody told me how to say sponsor me in Spanish, I forgot. Patrocinarme. Patrocinarme. Por fin. No, wait, keep that on. I'm trying to wear a tank top just so I can go there. And it looked like a little boy, so Rachel's like, I see this really cute tank top if you just cut it a little bit. It's so like cut it a little bit and it's just like here. That don't look that bad. <laughs> it looks cute from far away. Like if it's up close, then it looks a little bit. No, nice. really did it too much. Alright, so we're about to go to the store to see what we can find to eat because we're hungry. I feel like I'm hungry in everyday vlog. <laughs> Yeah, look at this motherfucker still in bed. I ain't no mother fricker. I'm in the Lexus. And <laughs> all right, guys. So this is what the resort looks like. I don't know how big it is, but we're about to go look for something to eat. But this looks like a mansion right here. Real bomb. We with Des and we met up with Nay again, and it's currently damn near two, and our parents are still not here. That's cute. I want to take some of these home. Dude, get one. They're probably like five hundred million dollars. Baby tax in here, but those are so bomb. So we just came up on this deli spot. Oh, this is a market they're talking about. About to make that market. Why are walking in? Do you smell it? Yeah, I do smell it. <laughs> Was that really you? There's like a deli thing place, I think, where you can... Why are you recording me like that? Where you can get food? Yeah, I know I'm sounding like a complainer right now. Todo eso. 500 pesos. This actually looks bomb, I'm not gonna lie. I'm just not used to these damn prices. This is my tea. That was 80 pesos. Basically, there's a whole little store right here in the market I was showing you guys. They have everything you can find in regular grocery stores in Mexico and like the Oxus and stuff. But they have them like 20, 30 pesos higher than the normal prices. It's like a little scammer store. Okay, yeah, so we're going to the pool right now. Look how cute this little walkway is. This will be bomb for pictures. It's packed. All the chairs are gone. Over there, it's even worse. So I think we're gonna go to the beach. Look how bomb my best friend looks. Hold on. Model. <laughs> Y'all. Oh my God. <laughs> Y'all. <laughs> Look how big those waves are. We're at the beach right now. As y'all can see, these waves are crazy. But I'm probably gonna chill, tan a bit, and then I'm gonna jump in. I look cute. So, so look who just we showed up. The presentation because we're professional. He, he said we're professional <laughs> scammers. So we do this presentation. They try to sell us a timeshare. We get a bunch of free gifts. But we just well, did it for the free gifts. Yes. <laughs> and we're supposed to be there only 90, 75 minutes, but we're there five hours. What do we get? We got a horseback ride for eight. Free. <laughs> and then we got a boat ride with a glass bottom for ten. The glass boat ride? And we got yeah. a free ride to the hotel and back. Free. Bum. So we got all that for free while we suffered here without parents. Yeah, right. And then we came back and the whole home. place is trash. There's cereal everywhere, trash everywhere. Let me get my baby and get out of here. And they had the baby the whole time. Pobrecita. First of all, why is this pad like literally flipped? And I can't unflip it. I'm a genius. What? Bruh. Why is this literally connected to the shirt? I'm gonna tell you guys basically the story time on what happened with that lady. Literally the clip when we were sitting on the beds, me and Nay, the lady to my left was the girl we got an argument with. Obviously I didn't get her on the video or nothing because like I'm not that childish, but like if she was talking more mess, yeah, I would have put her in the vlog. I was ready to get the whole fight in the vlog. Get it cracking, you know what I mean? Girl. Babe, you took your little self to the pool, not trying to talk to nobody. No, 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 no. let me tell you why. The, the girl's husband was there. If I got into Baby, it, the he girl was, was gonna get into it. He, I just walked away. He was not there when we were first arguing. I didn't see you. Dude, I was right there the whole time and she's talking about, you weren't even there. I was right there the whole time. I don't remember, no, but I was seeing red. I didn't see nobody. Laugh. 
Okay. <laughs> so basically what happened is there was like this whole place, all those chairs are full y'all and y'all seen it when i showed the video like literally there's barely any chairs like i was low-key irritated because everybody has their towel on a chair there's like hella chairs with just towels but nobody there so i'm like bro y'all taking up these chairs and not even using them but anyways we found two chairs and then there was two more chairs with this family and they were about to leave i peeped they're about to leave like we already had our stuff on the other chair and i was waiting for them to leave literally standing right on their chair like this is their chair and i'm standing right here like obviously i'm gonna get that chair those chairs you know so then this lady comes up out of nowhere and asks them if they're using the chair and they say no obviously they're leaving so i told her right away i was like oh actually we we're waiting for these chairs she catches the attitude with me right away she's like well i just asked her and you did and I was like, um, you can clearly see I'm waiting here. Like, I didn't need to ask because I can see she's leaving. Like, I have common sense in my damn brain. You know what I mean? And she's like, well, I asked before you did. First of all, this lady is grown. She has kids. She probably has kids my age. She was grown as hell. She was trying to act like we came after. Like, we weren't there waiting the whole time. Like, she was literally trying to act like we just pulled up. I was like, you literally see, we have all our stuff right here. We've been here. I've been waiting for this chair right here. And the whole reason I got an attitude with her is because she catched attitude with me. I wasn't even trying to be mean. I said straight up, like, Sorry, we already asked for these chairs and that was it. You know what I mean? And she wanna catch a damn attitude with me. Desiree comes in out of nowhere and she's like, you blah, 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 blah. I'm like, Desiree, bro, relax. Like, seriously, y'all know how Desiree is. Like, she just be popping off at the wrong time. Like, I was ready to fight, but Desiree's the type of person that like, she gonna get a shot type stuff. It's done, whatever, we sit down. I stay in that one chair and she gets the other chair. She's literally sitting right next to me and I don't care, like I'm, you know, living my best life. I'm in Kylo. I can tell she was irritated and me and A was just living our best life. So, boom. I don't care. I'm not even saying slick comments. Like, it's just after that, it's cut off. Like, I'm done. Me and A are just talking about whatever. I'm chilling. Tell me why. Desra's about to leave to go to the apartment. I see her, like, put her phone like this. Try to do it slick. And then she turned it off real fast. Because I was laying down and I come back up. And I'm like sitting here waiting for her to unlock her phone because I want to see if she's on the camera app because I know she just took a picture like you're not slick. So then she finally unlocks it and it's on the camera app. So I was like, um, did you just take a picture of my sister? And she's like, I'm, I'm, I'm stuttering and stuff. And she's trying to change the subject. I'm like, I don't care about none of that. She was like, I didn't come here to have a problem. Like, I don't want to be ghetto, blah, 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 blah. Like, I could be ghetto if I want. Just hella off topic. And I'm just like, I just want to know if you took a picture of my sister. And then she was trying to say, my kids over there, I took a picture of them. If you're taking a picture of your kids why are you being slick and doing it right here you should have held it up you know what i mean and i should have asked her to show me her camera roll but like we probably would have started fighting at that point because she was being like defensive because obviously she took a damn picture and i wasn't even like arguing i was just like i'm not trying to argue or do nothing either i'm just saying like if somebody took a picture of your family or your daughters you wouldn't want that right you would say something you would be mad so why are you trying to take a picture of my sister and blah blah, blah she keeps denying it and then she tries to tell us she told us when we first started arguing she was like i have daughters like i have older daughters i was like i don't care we can get down tell them come over here we can get a crack in and then she was like, I'm not about to do this right now because she had her like eight year old. And I was like, you better not do it right now because that's embarrassing. Your daughter's right here. Like, don't embarrass yourself. Like, act grown. You know what I mean? Like, I can act like this because I'm 21, okay? But you're old as f and you have a whole family. Like, please don't act like that. She's the one who got an attitude first to me in the first place. So, so that happens. She's just trying to deny it. And then she says again, like, and I didn't come here alone. I was like, I don't give a damn if you came alone. I didn't either. And we could get it cracking even if you didn't come alone. I mean, even if I didn't come alone. So whatever, we're chilling. I was so mad because we came up here because I have to upload my video and I didn't want to leave first because she's going to think she won, you know what I mean? I was ready to spend the whole damn day down there, you know? Like on my pride stuff but i had to upload for you guys so but yeah that's basically the story time oh and then her i forgot to tell you guys but her daughters pulled up four older girls like my age and this came and started talking to her and i'm just chilling like they didn't say nothing to me like did you think they were gonna get down because they don't look like it because personally if somebody was talking to my mom like that i would have got down you know what i mean but yeah they didn't say nothing to me i was literally thinking in my head thinking of the fight i'm about to happen like i was ready for it y'all ever do that or is it just me? Like, I always prepare first in my head. Like, even when I go to appointments and stuff, like, I'm preparing in my head, like, the conversations type stuff. But yeah, I was thinking, like, damn, I'm really gonna have to fight in a bikini right now? Like, my whole coochie and cheeses are gonna pop out. Like, that's gonna be so damn embarrassing in front of this whole resort. But, like, I'm down for it, you know what I mean? And then I was thinking, like, oh, I'm gonna, like, put on my camera so I can record this damn fight if it happens, you know? That was a really fun event. Like, that really got my energy up. Later, I'm gonna go down to the pool, and then that's probably gonna be the end of this vlog. It ended on a pretty damn good note, didn't you guys think? I wish I could have got us arguing on camera. That would have been so funny. I'm like, hi, at a resort, story time. But I'll see y'all later when we go down to the pool. Okay, y'all, so this is our swim outfits. Cute. 
Look how bomb my sister looks. Bomb.com. Bomb.com. Bomb. I'm probably not gonna take my camera down there because I took it down there already and it's just hella humid and hot and I don't want to risk any damages But we're gonna go swimming. This is big. And you already know the fizz. We looking bomb today I'm wearing the same clothes I, I, I slept with because honestly, I didn't come prepared for no beach, no nothing I came prepared for Cali. Are you serious? Man, they never listen. Like why I told you we come in the Cabo? Jesus Christ. You told me, but you didn't. Tell you we were going swimming too? Yeah, like how many? Cabo, okay. What does Cabo have? Like, I didn't know. All right, guys, so we'll see you guys after the beach. Bye. Yo, look, Michael's on the bed. gotta go this one. Thank you. Make it this way right now. Oh, my God. Bomb, we got our shot. Double for the birthday girl. So yeah,